When we talk about acute coronary syndromes, we're referring to the various degrees of occlusion in the coronary arteries and degree of damage to the myocardium or heart muscle. This includes unstable angina, non-STEMI or in-STEMI, and STEMI, S-T-E-M-I. STEMI stands for ST elevation myocardial infarction. So a non-STEMI doesn't involve the presence of ST elevation on a 12 lead EKG. All three types start with some sort of damage to the endothelium. Often this started with a lipid plaque. As damage occurs, a fibrin cap begins to form and eventually platelets begin to aggregate and develop a large clot. In unstable angina, the partial occlusion of the lumen often causes recurrent angina or chest pain. The pain is often relieved by medication, but it's going to recur. A heart cath or percutaneous coronary intervention, we're going to call that PCI, can be used diagnostically in these cases, but most often the clot dissolves and the endothelium eventually repairs itself. non stimmies are caused by partial occlusion of lumen, which causes ischemia to the myocardium. The myo myocardium suffers partial thickness damage in a non stimmy which is why we don't see the ST elevation. It's just that partial damage doesn't cause it. Ky cardiac biomarkers are elevated. There may be some minor EKG changes, such as an ST depression, and the pain is often exhibited as chest pain and activity intolerance. The patient will require PCI or thrombolytics because the longer it stays occluded, the more heart muscle is going to die. A STEMI is the most dangerous of myocardial infarctions because it indicates complete occlusion of a coronary artery. I mean, blood just cannot get through, which causes this full thickness damage and infarction. Remember, we said infarction is death to that heart tissue. So a piece of our heart has literally died. You're going to see prominent symptoms, market elevation of the cardiac biomarkers and ST elevation on the 12 lead EKG. Without revascularization in the form of a heart catheter thrombolytics, cardiac arrest, 